Hey folks, Matt from ArtOfTheImage.com. Interesting question on the uh, video comments here from Max. Max writes in, he says, I'm looking for a new camera to buy. The 80D would be the perfect camera, but is it still worth buying the 80D or should I wait for the 90D? And uh, so that's a good question. And I've had other people asking similar things because the 90D, we're, we're thinking it's imminent, but we don't have it yet. It's still essentially vaporware. We're talking about it a lot. At least I have been. <laughs> I'm interested to see what they do. Um, but I think the key to the answer to your question is you said the 80D would be the perfect camera. You can get an 80D right now, refurbed or used, for quite inexpensive. We're probably looking at less than $800. Um, you can also get an SL2, which does most of what the SL, the 80D does, and it's smaller and lighter. So depending on what you, what you want to do, uh, basically the only thing you're losing is more battery life and a better uh, autofocus tracking system. So if you're looking for that more enhanced autofocus, letting the camera track things and whatnot, it's probably a little better on the 80D. But the SL2, if you're a center point shoot and recompose guy, focus recompose, which is what I tend to do a lot of. A lot of people shoot that way. Depends what you're shooting, of course. Um, the SL2 is is everything you probably need smaller, lighter, and less expensive. So perhaps consider an SL2, spend a little bit more money on lenses, or yeah, get your 80D, get a refurb, get a used one. And um, if the 90D comes out and it's everything you want and it has you know some things in it that you want over the 80D, you won't be too far behind the 8-ball to sell either, either your SL2 or your 80D because... You should be able to get a decent price for them, especially the 80D if you've bought it used or refurbed. The other thing is, what about the M50? I know you didn't bring that up, but it gives you probably everything we're going to see in a 90D, or at least a lot of it. You get in the 4K, small and light, really cool looking little camera, 10 frames per second. Perhaps that's something you really should look at because to me, I would buy the M50 right now over an 80D. I don't think there's really almost any situation I could see myself buying an 80D instead of the M50. Um, but to me, the other option would be if you want to save some money, get the SL2, perhaps even refurbed, put a bit more money into lenses. What would you guys do? SL2, 80D, M50? Let us know what you guys would do and why. Maybe there's another option we should throw in. I think those are the three that covers it good there. I think we're. I think that's it. But maybe I'm wrong. <laughs> Let me know in the comments below. Uh, what would you guys do and why? Let's help out Max. Help him uh, figure out what he wants to buy here. It's always great to hear back from you guys. Thanks for your question, Max. Stay tuned. We'll be back soon here at artoftheimage.com.